Hi everyone. The Somerset, Wisconsin, Wisconsin. <laughs> Can't help but uh, have a little bit of a northern accent there when I say that. But it's in Somerset, Wisconsin, coming up on May 19th. So that's coming up pretty quickly since it's late April here. And what I'm started to think about now is what shoes I'm going to wear, along with what shirt, shorts, and all that, so I don't rip my clothes apart and have to throw them away. If, but I also want to make sure I'm dressed appropriately for the weather and all the mud and the rain and whatever else it's supposed to be. It's still far enough off where I don't really know what the weather would be like, but I'm guessing it would probably be pretty warm in the 60s or something. But I have a couple of shoes here. This first one is the shoe that I wear for all my workouts. It's the Innovate Flight 195, whatever. It's a minimalist, or minimalist shoe. It's really light. I think it's like six ounces. I want to wear that one, but I don't want to ruin my shoe because I, I paid pretty good money for the shoe and I love the shoe. So I'm not probably going to wear that one. But the other options I have, if I go with something I already use, or already have, this is the A6 Gel Cumulus 13. And I use that one for running right now. I'm supposed to be in a 10K upcoming here pretty quickly, but I did something to my foot yesterday, so I'm not quite sure if... I'm going to do that or rest or, or what I'm going to do. But that's my running shoe. And then this is the actual lawnmower shoe for the lawn. It's been degraded down to lawn mowing shoe. And it's a little rough. It's been around the block a little bit. But I ran this. I used this out on a trail recently. And it worked pretty well even though it's beaten down just a little bit. But I want something that is going to be able to let out a water with a mesh type of, of material that where I can let the water out and any mud and all that sort of thing is not going to clamp on the shoe where I, I can't run. It's going to feel like a brick. So I really don't have any good answers yet. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do. I might look around for some other shoes that are not terribly high priced but something that's real light and it's going to get all the water out so I can actually keep running without any excuses. Stay tuned, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you soon.